I just put on perfume and when I sprayed it, I was talking, I was just on the phone. And now my whole mouth tastes like perfume, so <laughs> this is great. Um, what's up guys, welcome back to another vlog. I was not planning on vlogging today actually, just because the next two days are not very exciting, but I'm gonna go shoot some street style photos in Soho and it's such a nice day, I was like, I cannot not take you guys with me. We're also a little blurry right now. There we go. Um, so yeah, street style photos. I am meeting up with this photographer who I've been trying to meet up with for a month, two months maybe. Um, it always goes like this, honestly. There's like never a time that it works out for both of us and today we finally have that time. So I'm gonna meet up with her really quick, take some pictures. Um, I'm wearing this really cute outfit. It's very on trend, so I'm quickly gonna show you guys that too. And then we're gonna head out. Okay, so quick side note, I am still trying to get a new mirror. I actually really wanna set the mirror up against the wall, like where my coffee machine is, um, and just have like a big full length mirror. But the one that I wanna get has been sold out for like six months now. Um, so. I just thought I would give you guys that update. But anyway, I am, I'm wearing this blazer from Aritzia. I just got it. I will have it linked down below. It's like a nice little oversized blazer. Um, let me just throw that away real quick. And then I just paired that with a little Zara tank. This is the one that I showed in my clothing haul the other week. And then these pants are also from Zara. I know that I said that I don't really shop at Zara anymore, which is true, but um, I was looking for a pair of pants like this for such a long time. And I just could not find the right fit. I looked at Aritzia, I looked on Revolve, I looked pretty much everywhere. And then I saw these and I was like, oh, maybe this will be a good fit. So yeah, they're just a basic style, black, long, loose fitting trouser pant. Is that what you call them? I don't really know. Um, I think Zara calls them a tux pant, but they don't really feel like tuxedo material. They're just like a, more like a business pant, I would say, so. This is the outfit. I'll have everything linked so you guys can shop it. And I'll see you guys in Soho. Okay, I feel like a huge idiot right now. And it's just, in the moment, like you just don't think about it. Oh, shit, I should probably turn this off. Um, I just met a subscriber. <laughs> it's been so long since I met anybody who watches my videos, obviously because of COVID. And yeah, I think the last time I met somebody was last summer in Central Park. Oh, I'm sad, but I'm happy at the same time. If you're watching this, I love you. It was so nice meeting you. Um, she's a student at Pace, and she was just really sweet. But anyway, I'm in Soho. Photographer's not here yet. She's just running behind because the trains are a little weird on the weekend. Um, so I'm just going for a walk, and then I'll see her in a little bit. Okay, I'm here with my girl, Nice. Hey. We just shot some stuff. We're almost done. Yes, what? photos look oh, fire. Here. They look so, so good. She's a pro, so. <laughs> You're the pro. I need the help. You don't. Wait, hold on, guys. I'm gonna show you her outfit. Her outfit's popping. Okay, today, here we go. Outfit shot. Thank you. Look at that. Look at that. Outfit is popping. Show us the earrings. Show us the earrings. Let's see the accessories. And the necklace. Yes, and the bag. And it just. This is a full OOTD. She came ready. She came ready. <laughs> you guys will not believe my luck just now. I almost left my apartment and then I realized I didn't have my portfolio. Um, I just got a really last minute casting right after my workout, so I'm running. Like I literally don't even have time to put makeup on. I'm just running. <laughs> uh, but anyway, I went to check, my, check something on my camera and then I realized I didn't have a battery in it. And, um, wow, this is a great angle. If I hadn't checked my camera, I would have left the apartment without a battery and I would not have been able to vlog all day. So thank you universe for having my back. I appreciate you. <laughs> um, anyway, it's Tuesday. I just got back from Gloveworks. Had such a good workout this morning with the girls. And, um, now I'm going to go to a casting. It's actually for a job tomorrow. So we'll see how it goes. Um, and then I have my hair cut, which I really, 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 really need. <laughs> I 
forgot to vlog everything, but hi. <laughs> she killed it again. <laughs> okay, I am back home. I feel like I've been rushing like crazy today. Um, it's been a while since I felt like that. Okay, so all she did was basically just do like a super small trim because my hair was not dead or anything like that. I just wanted her to like clean it up and then do like my pieces and face framing at the front and the layers in the back. And she also always thins out my hair because my hair gets super heavy, like at the ends and stuff. So that's what Deanna did. I'll leave her socials and stuff down below. Um, and then right now I need to actually do my makeup because I need to take some photos for a client. I'm gonna have to move all my stuff over again and take photos on that wall. I have to do a bunch of stuff. I have to take like full body photos both in clothes and in a bikini. And then I have to take like three quarter shots and I have to take a bunch of photos of my face as well. So it's gonna keep me busy for the next like hour or two. And then I actually ended up booking the job that I went to the casting for just now. So um, I'm working tomorrow and then I'm also working Thursday and Friday, which is so nice. I'm so happy about that. But because I booked that job tomorrow, I have to go get my nails done later too, so. I have a busy rest of the day, but it's all good because this is like what I've been waiting for for a really long time. So um, I'm going to get to it. I'm quickly just going to do like some natural makeup, make it easy for myself. And then um, I'm going to take some photos. <laughs> okay, so just finished taking the bikini set of these digitals. And now I'm going to do just full body. Uh, well, not full body, but outfit photos. Just wearing like a bodysuit and some jeans. <laughs> I'm gonna try and finish this up in the next like five ten minutes, but I don't think I've ever shown you guys how I take these photos So we'll show you that really quick um, I use a ring light. I love Just like the extra light that it adds especially on a day like today because I don't have that much natural light left <laughs> um, And then what I do is I use my iPhone for these photos. I just find it a lot easier than using a camera um, But I do use the back camera so you guys will see the back is like facing me. I just find the photos are better quality that way. And then I kind of just put it on the 10 second self timer and I hope for the best. Sometimes it takes me like two shots, sometimes it takes me 50 shots, I'm not even kidding you, um, depending on like what the client wants, but usually, usually it always works out. So I'm gonna set you guys up because I'm gonna try and finish this in like the next five minutes. Okay, I'm gonna give you guys a quick look because I think I've got what I need. These are not world-class digitals and um, that's why I always say like when you're taking digitals from home, like they're never gonna look as good as the ones that you take at the agency, but you wanna try and make them look as good as possible. I'm probably gonna try and brighten up the background a little bit um, just because there's not a lot of natural light, but this is, I'm gonna try and show you guys. This is kind of what I have. Um, for this client. Just got back home. I went to the grocery store after I finished taking those photos um, because I needed to stock up on a couple things. Got some water bottles and I actually also got this toner. It's an alcohol free toner from Neutrogena. I saw one of my favorite makeup artists post this on her story and um, I've been looking for a new toner, so I'll let you guys know what I think. And the real reason why I had to leave and go out is because I got some nail polish remover. I decided that I just cannot make myself sit in the nail salon for an hour. So I'm just gonna take my nail polish off and redo it myself um, while I edit and upload this vlog, so. You win some, you lose some. <laughs> um, I'm gonna close off this video just because I feel a little brain fried right now and um, I want to save some of my energy for editing this vlog and uploading it so 
I don't have to think about anything YouTube wise for the rest of the week So I love you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video if you did give it a thumbs up Don't forget to subscribe if you're new and I'll see you guys in the next one Mwah.